Hey folks, what's going on? This is Ryan coming at you again with another setup video. This is setup video 2.0. It's got some final additions added to the uh, added to the workstation. This is the workstation that I use for my tech support job, streaming, and trading. So it's got obviously has to be multifunctional. I also obviously use it for fun. Uh, I have my PlayStation hooked up to the middle monitor, so it's uh, it's work and play. But uh, made a couple additions to it, so wanted to make an updated video. First of all, I got the same chair. got the same Lazy Boy chair. You can see the computer is under the desk there, which I'm going to cover shortly. Uh, the computer is pretty much the same. Uh, it's the ASRock Z68 Extreme 4. It's the uh, Core i7-2600K Sandy Bridge, overclocked to 4.6. Water cooling with the Antec Cooler 920. The NVIDIA GeForce GTX 980, which I also overclocked. 32 gigabytes of Corsair Vengeance DDR3 overclocked as well. Samsung 500 gig solid state drive. 2 terabyte mechanical drive. Magewell XI100D uh, HDMI capture dongle, which is what I use to capture the signal from the PlayStation. Um, an Electro Voice RE20 microphone. Maybe hard to see right there. This is the. Uh, the professional studio mic that gives an incredibly uh, incredibly quality sound and I'm actually driving that with a uh, Zenix, I believe it's pronounced um, USB mixer so pretty much all I have going in there right now is the microphone but uh, I gain some audio controls from the mixer and it produces a really really clean sound to the computer great for making videos and uh, great for also for streaming um, the display is the middle display right there is a Samsung 4K ultra high definition 28 inch monitor. The one on the left is an Acer uh, 4K ultra high definition 28 inch monitor. So there's two 4K displays uh, on the setup now instead of just one from before. Um, on the right here I have a 1080p Samsung 24 inch monitor and the top one is almost 24 inches. It's a Samsung 23.4, 23.6 inch monitor. It is on a monitor arm that I got from Ergomart and I just want to say Ergomart has the best monitor arms out there. So if anyone is looking for a monitor arm for their uh, setup or for their work or if their work's looking for one, I highly recommend going to Ergomart. They have any different type and style of monitor arm that you could possibly want and the quality is phenomenal so is the customer service. So uh, hats off to Ergomart yet again. I also have the uh, Sennheiser Office Runner headset that I use for all my telephone calls including the Skype calls and all that stuff like that. I added the uh, Core, I went back to a mechanical keyboard so I bought the uh, Corsair Strafe uh, RGB Cherry MX Silent keys. Uh, I, I like well, I like mechanical keyboards. I actually really like the soft click of some of the uh, uh, smaller um, membrane keyboards. So um, the Silent keys give me the best of both worlds. It's still a uh, mechanical keyboard, and um, the keys are not too clicky. They're they're a nice blend, a nice blend for someone that likes the membrane keyboards. Uh, I also have a Logitech G700 lasered uh, wired and wireless gaming mouse, Logitech HD Pro, or HD Pro uh, C920 webcam, uh, the Azure Hurricane 2000 full tower case, so it's uh, the full tower. I run Windows 10 Pro because Windows 10 is the best product Microsoft has ever released. Sorry Windows 7 guys, it's a good operating system but it's not as good as Windows 10. Windows 10 surpasses it in almost every possible way. And then the big addition is the desk. So obviously this was the old desk that I had. I went ahead and made an L in my office room here. But my desk is actually an Apex brand sit-stand desk. Now I know sit-stand desks are all the rage. For good reason, they are awesome. Uh, obviously a, a full, full work day will sometimes take eight hours, eight hours plus, especially more if I'm gonna play some video games. So uh, you really can't sit for that long. It's really not good for you. It's uh, not good for your back. My back actually started to hurt after the first year and a half half of, of trading and uh, I've heard it only gets worse so we uh, I went ahead and tried to correct the problem as much as possible obviously stretching um, really really helps but the sit stand desk allows you to uh, go from a sitting position which it's in right now so I'll push the chair in there for comparison so the perfect height for me for for sitting at the desk and uh, it's motorized so if I ever want to stand right down here I have a little control for it and as you just press that, the desk just, the motorized um, desk just goes up. 
and into a standing position. So once it's fully up, you can see now the desk is in a full stand position. So I can stand stand there at it instead of sitting down. And it's great too because I've obviously got four displays on the desk. The desk has no trouble lifting that. The fourth display is on a monitor arm. It has no trouble lifting that and all of the extra peripheral stuff that I have on it. The only word of advice I have is that if you do this, you're going to need probably some extension cables. Ah, cords. Look at all those cords. It's really only noticeable when the desk is up and obviously when I'm standing at it, I'm much closer and don't really see it. So. It's not that big of a deal, but um, sit-stand desk, highly recommend it. This is the Apex sit-stand desk. It's 72 inches wide by 33 inches deep. It is incredibly big. It fits everything on there. It's wonderful. It's easy to use, and uh, I highly recommend the sit-stand desk for anyone in an office setting. If you have any questions about your own setup, about this setup, or how to, uh, how to do anything, please drop me a line. Have a good one.